Sayyidina Ali Zain al Abidin was praying and one of the pillars in the masjid uh, broke and there was a, a large you know sound and a crash that happened when it took place and after he was done with the salah they asked him what did you you were in the masjid when the pillar broke and it and he didn't hear anything and there was a sahabi who had to have his leg amputated he said you know when you get, it's going to be intense it's painful he said amputate my leg when i'm in the salah these are the realities that the Sahaba had radiallahu anhum and they amputated it and he uh, became aware of it after he finished his prayer radiallahu anhum. Now these stories are not meant to make us feel like, oh, I'm so terrible, I can't even do 1% of that. But it's a, it's, it shows us the potential and the possibility. And when we hear about these great people, it is meant to encourage us and inspire us, not the other way around. Like, oh, I'm never going to be like that. I I'll, might as well, you know, pack my bags and just like, I'm useless. I can't do that. No, that's not what we want. See, inshallah, the one who gave to them can also give to me, subhanahu wa ta'ala. The one who chose those people to be of the people of nearness to him can choose me, inshallah, to be of those people.